Hi, this is the second episode of the GoGen Planner Cast. Um, I have a podcast where I talk about knitting, crochet, and spinning, but this is where I'm going to focus on how I use my Foxy Fix faux dory. Um, I'm participating in the Lister's Got a List challenge on uh, YouTube and also in the one month July challenge. So this was about the second week I've had my planner and I went around the house and collected all the pens and markers I could find. Um, I found uh, my daughter's old pencil box from school and put my pens in there but I was really struggling with the organization of it. That was not making me happy. Um, this is some things I had gotten from um, Hobby Lobby and I ordered the Micron pens from Amazon and the uh, masking sticker set is they're just little pieces of um, washi tape on paper so they're, all, they're easier to manipulate than the washi tape on the roll. You can cut them in half, punch shapes out of them. So I, I really do like them. Um, I had ordered some stickers from Vintage Gypsy Road on Etsy. Um, the stickers are just fine, and they were the only place I found that had uh, yarn and crafting stickers. So I bought their knitting and crochet sets, and also some glasses and arrows, and then puppy paw prints. Um, my only problem with them was that it took three weeks to come, and that was just too long for me to wait for anything. <laughs> I also went to Hobby Lobby, and their Stamp, uh, Stampalicious brand, which I think is the Hobby Lobby brand, were 50% off this week. So I got uh, the paper cutter, the bear stamp, and the yin yang stamp, and uh, stamp pad 50% off. Um, went to Office Depot and got some things out of their sale bin and I also got myself a, a four color Kalido pen and at Hobby Lobby I used my 40% off coupon to get this craft box and that makes me really happy because it's got lots of storage for the stickers, the pens, the washi I can keep it all in one place um, this is where I left you on my last week's planner cast when I was doing the One Book July. These are my journal pages, and they've made me happy. I'm learning as I go through, because you see how I had to rewrite the things on the right side of that page, because when I was entangled in the bottom of the, this page, it bled through so horribly. Um, this is a, a page I decided I wanted to make as a planning page, and so I took a piece of that uh, washi tape and folded it out over the edge just a little bit so that I can find it when I want to go back in there. And um, so I've just been journaling, making my plans. Uh, it is so much fun to make a checkbox because it's so rewarding to put a check in that box. Now I'm ready for the next page. So that was my journal. Here is my planner. This was um, last week's page, nice and neat. And this is my this week's spread. So you can really see that I'm getting into it more. I'm enjoying myself more. Um, checking off things. I made a, a paper clip flag for myself. I just took a piece of that washi tape and cut it in half and stuck that, since it's sticky, I stuck it together uh, to make myself a, pla a bookmark flag to keep my place. And I made my own little checklist box down at the bottom of the page and that really made me happy because I would like to do so many things every day. Um, I'm in a spinning challenge in the Ravelry group online where I'm trying to spin yarn every day. 
uh, I want to make sure that I participate in my listers got a list challenge did I journal did I zentangle I would like to post a picture to Instagram every day um, what kind of mood did I have and that kind of thing and so for next week I got fancy and I printed one out on the printer so this is what next week's sp uh, spread looks like okay this is the listers got a list challenge and this is how I left it last week July 4th um, and then these are the challenges for every for every two days of course as it goes um, they're, they're really fun to do because they make me think in a different way or think about things that um, maybe I don't think about in you know other ways so um, sometimes they're a stretch but most of the time I have a really good time with it today's challenge was what are you wearing like you know what are you wearing now I don't know where else to go with that. To me, that's just okay. I'm wearing a tank top and shorts. What? It, that's that's it. <laughs> so I don't have anything else for that. But I'm ready for tomorrow's challenge. And um, so that's all I have for uh, this week. I am loving my book, and it makes me very happy. I'm doing the One Book July Challenge, and Lister's got a list. Uh, you can find me as Gojen on uh, Instagram, Ravelry, and YouTube.